What is up gamers and haters and welcome back to Twisted Vid Gaming. I am the Twisted Vid Gamer and today you are joining me for Titan Live Episode 5. Uh, in this episode I want to talk to you guys a little bit about the weapons and the anti-Titan weapons. Um, I'm not going to sit and bother going through a lot of the stats because I know you guys, there are a lot of other YouTubers that already do such thing. Um, I'm not going to sit and go through that. I just want to give you guys my opinion on these weapons. Um, I actually really don't have too much to complain about. I really kind of think everything's well balanced. Um, the one thing I wish they did have in this was, um, I wish they had more weapons. Um, but if you guys haven't seen the other episodes, uh, please, please go check those out. I will leave the, oh, God damn it. I will leave the link for them in the description below. Uh, I've, I think there's four episodes out already. Um, and that fourth episode is Twitter and YouTube shoutouts. If you guys want to be part of that, all you got to do is give us some love, give us some support, come show, um, come show us you care. Come show us you like these, and I will continue to do them for you, and you can be part of the shoutouts. Oh shit, they got me. Um, to get on with this here though, um, like I said, I really don't have um, too many complaints. The one thing I wish they did do, I wish they gave us more selection of guns. Um, so far my favorite is that longbow sniper rifle and this assault rifle. Um, and the hemlock is actually really nice too, I'm a fan of the three round burst kind of thing. Die, 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 die. Um, the wish, the, I, I wish they would have uh, given us something to work for too. With these weapons, there's really not that much. They go kind of quick. You blow through anything for them pretty fast. Oh, what the hell didn't I get you? Whatever. Die. I got an invisible bitch running around here. There we go. Oh my god, leave me the fuck alone! <laughs> Uh, I still have, I'm still trying to figure out a lot of this game. I do like this. I've learned a lot playing it. Um, I just don't get the opportunities that I thought I would get to play this. So I'm still kind of a noob, I guess, you'd say. Um, but back to the weapons here. There, uh, there's just really not a, a wide range of weapons. And so there's really not a whole lot to talk about with them. Um, like I said, my favorites are about the only ones I think probably they're my favorite just because I've used them so much and I am used to them. Um, but the anti-titan weapons, to me, there's again, there's not a lot, uh, wide range for the anti-titan weapons. I'm really not impressed with them either. I kind of feel like they're not really that effective. If you don't have a titan, you're not really going to kill another titan. I mean, it is possible, but it's just a pain in the ass. Come here. No, it's just a spec. Um, I also feel like um, there should be a... Um, I also feel like for the anti-titan weapons, you should be able to unlock so something for them. There's not really anything you can unlock for them. They just are there. It's just all it is. It's really... I, I think that sucks the most. Damage core already. This is why I don't get my back. I'm going to hop out of this bitch before I get blown the hell up. Um, the sidearms, too, in this game. I'm, I'm actually a really big pistol user on Call of Duty. On here, not as much. They're... They're good and they're effective, but I just think with everything being as big as it is, you're really not... You, it's just not... Um, it's just not likely to be able to shoot someone that far away with a pistol on this game, especially with all the action that is going on. It'll get a little crazy. Shit. <laughs> See, this is what I was talking about, guys. The, the anti-titan weapons really aren't that effective. I'm shooting the shot at this guy, and he's just there's, acting like he's not even being hit, really. It's taking these other titans to gang up on him to get him out. I mean, I know I'm supposed to aim that red thing on him, and it probably will help a lot. Seems like I'm actually getting him. I got him. That's like the first Titan I think I've killed without help. I do like, though, with the anti-Titan weapons that you... Oh, you fucking prick. Damn it, why didn't I look up? I feel like with the anti-Titan weapons, though, you, um, you do get the opportunity to shoot other people and uh, bots with them. <clears throat> That's really nice. Instead of having to keep switching back and forth, you know, between weapons. It's very effective. Um, also, too, to get on with some other things, the Titan loadouts. Uh, most of the weapons don't seem very effective to me. I, of course, like I said, I don't really use my Titan that much, so maybe it's a little different for the rest of you guys. If so, please let me know in the comments below what some of you guys' favorite loadouts are if you've played this. Um, I just, I don't really, I, I'm just so, I think it's just because I'm so used to Call of Duty that it's just not really something I, I mean, I like having the Titans and I like that they have my back, but... I don't really care to use it. It just seems like I'm gonna die faster doing that. The um, 
there's a small weapons range for them too. It they just they I, I really hope when they come out with the DLC for this that they just add so much more because it's really a great game. There's just not a whole lot to it, and there's not really anything that's keeping me on this as much as I thought there would be. There's just really not a oh you fucking prick, man. There's just really not a whole lot. Oh, he kicked me from behind. What the hell, Hefe? <laughs> oh, I love this. <laughs> Um, but some of the other things too, um, there is tactical abilities, ordinances, and tier 1 and tier 2 kits. The tactical ordinances, they range from a vortex shield, which um, it protects you and it kind of takes some, um, like it, it uh, as, if someone's firing at you, you can grab their bullets and stuff and kind of throw them back at them, which I thought was really cool. And then there is an electric smoke shield. Um, it's just basically a charged, like, smoke grenade that pops out of you. If there's somebody on you, it kind of blows them off of you. And, and it'll kill and, and affect any titans around you and things like that, which is really nice too, because you don't always want to have to hop out of your titan and take a chance to get killed just because of that. Damn it. I'm not going to do so hot this round, guys. I'm still trying to learn how to do this live comments as we're doing this, so thank you guys for being patient with me. Did I just get him? Oh my god, I did. Oh shit, maybe I didn't. I really enjoy playing this, though. I really hope you guys enjoy these titan live, this Titan Live series. It's been something that um, has definitely opened me up on a lot of... Uh, social things here it's kind of um, helped me get used to talking and stuff like that oh did I just I did I just jumped on one hell yeah die motherfucker die die motherfucker die oh I should have got off of him damn oh uh, really you just let that dude stab the fuck out of you what are you doing oh we won I'll be damned. Uh, but to get on to, there's a particle wall. It's pretty much kind of like this, only if your Titan can kind of stand behind it and you can shoot through it, but they really can't shoot you, which is really nice. Uh, and that's about the only time I've really ever uh, used my Titans if I can be protected here. Uh, but the ordinances, the ordinances range from different missiles to rockets and warheads, uh, things like that, all this different stuff for your Titan, which is really cool because that does kind of help. Uh, that's the one thing besides the weapons that I do like on the Titans is that you got rockets and stuff like that, and those do seem to be pretty effective. So he, he's freaking on fire. Let's get him. Let's get him. Oh, damn. Somebody else got him. We're not going to let them escape. Uh, but to get on before this is over, the Tier 1 and Tier 2 kits, they offer different perks for the Titan and yourself as well. It's kind of like Call of Duty where you got all these extra perks. Only in these ones, they're really nice. Um... They offer things like a regen booster, fast auto reloader, um, and, and just a lot of different things. Really neat. If you guys ha don't have this game, you should definitely invest in getting it. It's definitely a game worth having. Um, but uh, the next thing we're going to do in the next episode, I'm going to talk about the maps and burn cards a little bit and give my personal opinion on them. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this right here. All my social links are in the description below. All of our video links, um, some playlists will be in the description below. If you guys enjoyed this, please click the like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.